Uh, Malcolm, now I don't know if you saw this. I'm assuming something amazing happened during this interview because this shit's been trending. But this is UFC 241 Nate Diaz Octagon interview. I think this is after he even... Oh, uh, after he won. won. But it's trending, and I'm trying to figure out why. Probably something. But the thumbnail is him like this, also. Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> we have to find out. <laughs> oh, it's starting three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard. He's the winner? The judges score the contest. 30-27. Okay, I'm in this fight. At 29-28, for the winner, by unanimous decision. He's the fucking winner. Whole fucking eyebrow gone. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with your winner, Nate Diaz. <laughs> What was it like being away, and what is it like to be back and get a nice victory like that over Anthony Pettis? It's Nick Diaz Army. Well, they just blanked that shit up. <laughs> Play <laughs> with shit. Do you think you will be back permanently now? You took a nice long layoff for three years off. Damn. After this great fight and having this great victory, do you think we'll be seeing you fighting regularly now? The reason I was off is because everybody sucked. Damn. 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 But with this uh with this belt I want to defend it against uh Jorge Masvidal had a good last fight. Good last fight. All respect to the man. Talk your shit, I guess. In this game anymore. There ain't nobody who done it right but me and him. So I know my man's a gangster, but he ain't no West Coast gangster. You know what I'm saying? Well, that'll be a fantastic fight, Nate. I'm assuming this that's him. A great mm -hmm. fight for you tonight. A great fight to come back against a guy like Anthony <clears throat> Pettis. Was there anything surprising about this tonight? No, I just worked out a little different this time. I worked out more like, probably more like he does. It's like a piece of pace from the beginning. So I'm used to five, mount, five round fights. So I got <laughs> tired of trying to go hard. <laughs> I think I do better in a longer fight. Make it happen the way it's supposed to happen. Congratulations, sir. Enjoy your victory. It was great to see you back. Shout out to my corners, Richard Perez, the best boxing coach in the world. My partner who runs the Nick Diaz Academy, Randy Smith, and the legendary Carl Gracie. The man at Gracie Jiu Jitsu, Stock in California, baby. You already know what's up. Nick Diaz, ladies and gentlemen. That nigga said I took three years off because all you niggas was sucked. Gauntlet. <laughs> like, Grown. <laughs> Oh shit! Said you niggas was trash. <laughs> he said I ain't had nobody to fight. I took off. <laughs> oh shit! That's cold blooded, bro. Hey. He said fuck y'all. Hey, if you don't like his words, go beat his ass. <laughs> <laughs> meet, him, meet him in the octagon. Like, come in the if you feel different, I mean, meet, you know where to meet me. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't hot. Uh, 